Hi there, my name is Alejandra Cerda and today we will create our own Instagram stories filter. So you will need a few things and those are linked in the description box below. Uh, and you will need to start with a reference photo in Lightroom. You are probably already familiar with Lightroom. So you just click around, use your reference photo and click on the presets you probably already have or you create a new one. This is a preset I use that is called Codebean, I think. And then you just apply it on this file called color base that is linked in the box below and you need to download it and then you apply your preset to it. I'm trying out a couple of different ones here. Uh, this one is called Luve, which is the name of my husband and then you just export it as a JPEG and save it to a folder or your desktop. And now you have to open Spark, so if you haven't downloaded Spark already, you need to do that now before you can continue. So let's open a blank project and import the same files as we, all, uh, we just exported. So this is the fast color LUT that is linked in the description box that you need to import. And then of course your two color base filters. You then go to a camera, you add a canvas, and now you want to add a rectangle. You want to fill the whole frame with this rectangle, and you click materials, so you will have this gray box to start with. Uh, you now want to click uh, this little button called texture and go to camera and then click texture extraction so you will have these different I don't know what to call them like little tools maybe and then you just connect them and you need to make sure to connect them to the right little button or output or I don't know what they are called, those little circles. And then you uh, can try your filter um, on different skin tones. And please keep in mind that these are all selfies to see what selfies will look like. So this is me. You can try it on yourself by opening the camera effect. So that's pretty much it. Then you just save it and export it and thank you so much for watching!